Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of the Industrial Packaging Podcast with me, your host, Nathan Duby, Digital Marketing Specialist at Industrial Packaging. On today's episode, we are going to discuss shrink film versus bop film. What's the difference? So without further ado, let's jump into today's topic. During your journey through educating yourself about the different types of flexible packaging films, you have decided that you want to use shrink film or biaxially oriented polypropylene overwrap film, also known as BOP. However, you are not sure what the difference between these two types of flexible packaging films is. You want to understand the difference between these films so that you can choose the proper film for your product packaging needs. But you have not been able to find a comparison for these two films and it's been hard to get the answers that you're looking for. Luckily for you, however, today you have come to the Industrial Packaging Podcast. In this episode, we will compare bob film and shrink film. After listening, you will be able to choose the appropriate film for your packaging needs. Okay, so first things first, what is shrink film? Shrink film, also known as shrink wrap, is a type of flexible packaging film used to package food, board games, and many other consumer goods. It is most commonly made from polyethylene, polyvinyl chloride, or polyolefin. Shrink film is ubiquitous on countless packaging lines worldwide. When using shrink film, the product being packaged is put into a sleeve made from shrink film and sealed on both sides with a machine called a sealer. From there, the product is moved via a conveyor belt into another device called a heat tunnel. As the name would suggest, the inside of the tunnel is heated. As the product moves through the heat tunnel, the heat produced by the machine causes the shrink film to shrink uniformly around the product. From there, the product moves through the rest of the packaging line and gets packed for shipping. Okay, next question. What is biaxially oriented polypropylene film? Biaxially oriented polypropylene, also known as BOP film, is a kind of flexible packaging film. Unlike shrink film, a BOP is not heated and shrunk in a heat tunnel, but used as an overwrap film to package your products. An overwrap film is applied by wrapping the film over the product or over another form of packaging containing the product. BOP films are generally used for food packaging. However, they are also fast replacing cellophane for applications including snacks and tobacco packaging. For the most part, this is due to BOP's superior capabilities and lower cost. Biaxially oriented polypropylene film features increased barrier properties to oxygen and water vapor. Resistance to impact and flex crack are also better with BOP when compared to polypropylene shrink film. Alright, so the big question is, which is right for you? Shrink film or BOP film? You will have to answer a few questions before you decide which type of flexible packaging film is the correct type for your unique product packaging requirements. With the answers to these questions, you should be able to identify which of these two films makes the most sense for you. Question 1. Are your products extremely heat sensitive? If you answered yes, BOP film would be a better choice for you. Question 2. Do you want a film that will tightly encase your products uniformly? If you said yes, shrink film is better for your product packaging needs. Question 3. Do you require increased barrier properties to oxygen and water vapor for your products? If the answer is yes, BOP film would be a better choice for you. Question 4. Are you looking to use a light gauge of flexible film for packaging your products? If you said yes, light gauge shrink film is a better choice for your product packaging. Question 5. Are you looking for a film with higher resistance to impact and flex crack? If you answered yes, then BOP is a better choice for your packaging needs. Question 6. Are you looking to avoid using plastic packaging? If you said yes, neither of these films is a good choice. Question 7. Are you looking for a biodegradable packaging film? If you said yes, you would want to use biodegradable shrink film. With the answers to the questions that we just reviewed, you should have all the information that you need to choose the appropriate flexible packaging film for your requirements. Now that you know which type of film is the right choice for packaging your products, you're probably looking for pricing information on the kind of film you have chosen. Suppose you have decided that shrink film is the right flexible packaging film for your needs. In that case, you will want to consider reading this follow-up article, Shrink Wrap Film Cost, Factors that Influence Price and How to Calculate. With the information in this article, you will have everything you need to calculate your specific total cost for the amount of shrink film that will be required for your packaging project. On the other hand, if you have decided that BOP film is the correct type of material for your current packaging project, then you will want to read this follow-up article, How Much Does Biaxially Oriented Polypropylene Film Cost? Understanding Price. With the information in this article, you will understand how much BOP film costs. Both of these articles can be found in the description of this video. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that does it for another episode of the Industrial Packaging Podcast with me, your host, Nathan Duby, Digital Marketing Specialist at Industrial Packaging. I do hope you enjoyed today's episode. 
and I hope you will tune in for the next one. But until then, I hope you have a great day, and we'll see you next time.